Hi everyone and welcome back to Everything Lynn. I'm Lynn. Today we will be discussing the top five signs that a woman doesn't actually like you but will entertain you. Sign number one, it's been weeks into dating and she never initiates contact. A girl who likes you, like after a while, like that, you, that you've shown that you properly are pursuing her, like she will start, hey, you know, like sending you little texts throughout the day or she will initiate contact sometimes. If a girl doesn't like you, she is never really checking on you like ever. And you're gonna get to a point where you're gonna be like, dang, like it's always me reaching out to you, like always me reaching out to you. When will it be you reaching out to me? She doesn't really care to because she doesn't like you. Sign number two she's extremely slow to text back like when i tell you when i like somebody my phone is right by my side <laughs> and i'm waiting for that text from that guy that i like like i almost have to tell myself like yo chill like you don't have to text him back so fast like because you know we're trying to keep the suspense you know we're trying to be girls or whatever um yeah if it's taking hours or like half an hour or some odd to get back to you uh, yeah, chances are is it's because I was doing something else. Like I saw your text and I went back to TikToking and then I remembered and then I texted you back and it took hours. So yeah, if that's the case, like chances are she doesn't really like you like that. Number three, she doesn't ask questions. This was an example that I used in top five ways that a guy doesn't like you. But generally like people who aren't interested in you they are not going to be interested in getting to know you. So that means they're not asking personal questions. Like girlies, <laughs> like I know for me personally, when I like somebody, I wanna know how, what, when, where, and why you came about. Like what, what brought you to me? <laughs> what made you the man that you are today? You know, what happened in your childhood? I wanna know, I wanna know everything about you because I like you. So generally, if if like you're asking her questions and she's very short on the answers and she's not really like she's not genuinely interested in like asking you the questions or like not not just saying oh and you all the time or she's not coming up with questions herself like chances are is because she's not interested in getting to know you because she doesn't like you like that sign number four she's always busy if a girl like and you're trying to like put the mac daddy moves on her you know plan out the dates you know ask her her availability and it's oh i've got a thing or sure yeah i'll let you know like and it's not her like actively trying to figure out when you're both available to do this thing together like chances are she's not into you like if she's always busy or like once <laughs> once every two weeks she's finally got time for you you know she might just be a busy girl, but nobody's that busy, you know, like, unless she's the president of the United States, like nobody is that busy for somebody that they like. In fact, women are notoriously known for never being busy when it's a guy that we like, you know, and he's trying to spend time with us. Suddenly our date planners are completely open, you know, and it's open to the guy that we like. So if she's just consistently like always got a thing and it's never you that's the thing, um, she's not into you. Sign number five. So I did say sometimes these are the signs um, that women aren't into you, but will entertain you. So let's say that she allows for dates to happen. You know, she's polite enough to ask questions, you know, like to put on a show and be polite. But you can tell that there's not really something there. Like chances are she just enjoying being on dates or like getting to know you. Or maybe she's trying to like figure out if she likes you, but isn't sure yet. You want somebody who's sure about you. Sign number five is a telltale sign of how she feels about you. Her body language is not open to you. She's not receptive to any physical touch. If you're trying to put the moves on her, you know, like, like touch her arm or even like, you know, go from there. Sometimes <laughs> we'll hold hands and not think anything of it. You know, like we hold hands with friends, but let's say you graduate from there and like put your hand on like the small of her back and she's like, Ugh. you know, like you can tell that she somehow flinched up or something like that or like moved away bro, she's not, she's not into you. Like, I think sometimes, like I said, if it's in the, in the case of she's been on these dates with you and she's just entertaining you because you've texted her, um, sometimes we'll be trying to think whether or not we actually like you. But if we are flinching away from your physical touch, that is a telltale sign. 
like that's a no go. I would stop, like <laughs> drop her off home and then never contact her again. If she's not giving you kisses, if she's not receptive to the kisses, um, yeah, the girl is not into you. Cause like a guy that I like, I want him near me. I want him like around me all the time. I want him giving me kisses. So yeah, this list doesn't make women like by any means like just little demons or whatever like you know the manosphere is trying to portray us as sometimes we are trying to figure out you know like sometimes dudes are so dope on paper and the chemistry within us just isn't there so we try to make something happen so sometimes we will entertain the dates until we like absolutely are sure like this is not the one for me i'm so sorry you know so sometimes we give ourselves time and unfortunately like it's just not fair to you guys it's not fair to us you know but that's just how it is sometimes it doesn't make people bad people but what it does is put the ball in your court to be like can I accept this behavior from somebody? You know, if I can tell that this person doesn't like me, why am I pursuing anymore? You know, it's entirely up to you to just stop. <laughs> you know, like, like go pursue somebody who is actually going to reciprocate the feelings that you have. You deserve to feel that back, you know, especially if you're putting in the gentlemanly time and energy. You know, you deserve to have somebody who is reciprocating that back to you, like, and making you feel liked as well. So that's all that I have for this video. Keep your eyes open for things like that. Cause like I said, sometimes we're just polite. Sometimes we're trying to figure it out. Like I said, I hope you guys found this helpful. I will see you guys in the next video. Thank you so much for watching.